Welcome to the unboxing of the GoPro Hero 3, and when I focus it up, you'll find that this is the Black Edition. There we go. So I'm going to show you today what the GoPro Hero 3 Black Edition comes with. Uh, as you can see straight up, you can see the remote and the GoPro in its housing. And this is what it looks like from all sides. Let's take a look at the box. So the specs show us the what we can record in. So 480p, 1080p, 720p, 4K, etc. We can see that it's Wi-Fi enabled along with a couple of different specs. We can see the accessories that it can come with as well as the ones that it does come with. And then we've got on this side, um, essentially, the operating instructions of the GoPro and what you need to do with it. So, without further ado, let's get this bad boy unboxed. So, in true GoPro style, there are two sticky tabs here and on the other side. So, let's undo those first. and the outer casing or outer box slides off like that and there's nothing else inside that box as you can see it's just squashes flat so let's put that to the side the inner box is really really simple as well so starting on the front you've got learn more at gopro.com we have a logo show you how to take it off the mount at the very top another logo and then we can start pulling this piece of tape off all the way around. So once you've got the tape off, we can see that it just detaches from the plastic covering up the top here, and that can be removed like so. And this exposes us to the GoPro camera as well as the Wi-Fi remote. Now, the Wi-Fi remote seems to be hooked in with two extremely long twist ties so I'm not going to get rid of that yet and unfortunately because it's strapped in front of the GoPro camera and the GoPro camera launches out I can't get the GoPro camera off yet so we're going to dive straight into the box now it's worth noting that the first thing that you come across is a software update booklet you don't need to update the GoPro in order to use the camera it's just recommend you get the latest firmware so we'll put that to the side the next piece of paper tells us how to use the Wi-Fi remote the third shows us that we can obtain the manual from GoPro.com and the fourth in true uh, textile is the warranty information booklet as we can see here So let's get to further deep down inside the box. Um, there is a single black box which we can pull out like so. And then there is something that seems to be at the bottom. But funny enough, if I actually take the, the bottom end of the box out. So if we open this, which is a little bit tight, but we'll try and get there. There we go, pops open like that. Um, you'll find that the bottom is just completely empty and I'm not too sure why they put that there. So they could have made the box smaller, but eh, whatever. So there's the inside of the box. I'm now going to undo the Wi-Fi remote. So as you can see, that twist ties off like this and I'm probably going to look like a fool for trying to get this off. But as you can see, it just comes free and clean, well, as clean as possible, away from the box. Yeah, they've put it in there really, really good. So, pull that away. There we go. So, put that to one side. 
and we can now take off the GoPro, which you just push these two clips here and push forward and the GoPro comes forward like so. Hey, fantastic. So now that we've put the GoPro aside, I'm going to just quickly clean up and show you what is inside this black box. So let me push that over to that side and show you what's inside the black box. There we go. Uh, cables, etc. A little another mounting arm. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to tip it out so we can actually see what's in it. So there's empty. Push that to the side. So we have different sticky mounts, so you can obviously stick them to things. We have our GoPro stickers in true GoPro style. There is a key ring for securing the Wi-Fi remote if you want to put it on your key ring. We have the battery, so that will go into the back of it later. Now this is the charging thing for the remote, so let's get this away from the twist ties you can see they've really secured it really well, so um, there's no danger of it moving around from the box. But essentially the silver bit comes out, you push that into there and you stick that on the charger and away she goes. So that's nice and easy. We have a skeleton case door, so if you want to replace it and get some audio happening, so you can. We have an extendable arm, the USB charging cable, and obviously I'm pulling through the GoPro itself. So let's show you how to get this out of the case. It's relatively simple to get out of the case. We pull that forward, we push this up, and that releases it from its clip. Now we can actually pull the back up, and that means we can get the rear door open. So that is the GoPro in my hot little hands. In true simplistic GoPro style, the button on the front is on off as well as mode. The button on the top triggers recording. We have a Wi-Fi button because Wi-Fi is built in. The back casing and hat the door. And then underneath this little tab, which makes it nice and neat, is the micro SD card slot, the mini USB connection to offload and charge the unit, and a HDMI um, cable slot as well so you can output your stuff to HDMI devices. So that's the GoPro. I hope you've enjoyed watching this unboxing and if you'd like more unboxings please click the like button and comment to let me know and we'll see you in the next video.